I could, I would love to interview one of the unknowns, my predecessor, Mike. Uh, he was a starseed. He uh, possessed the gift of prophecy prediction. But it was more to it than that. It's like he could access time itself and slow it down if he wanted to. Now he's taught me a little. He, you, he did teach me. He teach me some of it. The rest I have to practice myself. But he never made it to fortune and fame. And I guess I have to uh, reconcile that myself because I don't understand why not. He accessed time, created a portal to an alternate timeline, and he went through it. I've been tracking his energy signature ever since. I've been tracking it through Florida. It started off in Levi County, Florida. That whole county looked so familiar. It started out as a mild case of deja vu. Like, hmm, I remember that being there, and hmm, I remember that, and hmm, I remember that. Noticeable, subtle, not overbearing or harsh. As you go into the next county, you go over the bridge, park right next to it. U.S. Route 19 is when it really started getting interesting. As you go over that bridge, about a block up, there's an RV park. And the sign on the other side, on the other side says, uh, Southeast uh, U.S. 19. But on the opposite side, adversely, there is no sign saying northeast or north or anything. However, that particular RV park looked really familiar, so it's getting stronger. As you continue up US 19, you get to uh, a place where on the left hand side on the corner, it is a Amoco or Amoco gas station, but it is a converted highs. I'm looking at this building and the surrounding land around it, and I start to critique it. And I said, same old raggedy concrete sidewalk, only it wasn't, it was, it was, it was. It wasn't blue before, it was green. And once I finished doing that instinctively, I said, wait a minute. I've not been here before. How do I know the dynamics of this building? That's when I knew it was more than deja vu. I had literally been there before. Had that feeling of having actually stood in that spot and seeing that building more than deja vu as you continue up US 19 you get to a point where it's a long stretch of road wide open with gray or silver towering power lines on the right hand side that's when it really hit I have been here before but that's not possible because I have not been up US Route 19 before. Unless it was Mike. Mike had been through there. Now, of course, I pulled out my pendulum and I asked and I checked and confirmed yes, Mike had been through there. So I started tracking from there his energy signature. Here I am about to go into Pensacola, Florida, and my physical strength is, or my physical body, I feel like I got a crown on my head, 
Like I feel like I got a hat or a crown on my head and it's tight. And it seemed like the closer I get to 89, Route 89, to go up Route 89 into uh, Pensacola, uh, there being a feeling of a hat or a crown on my head is getting stronger. I would love to really just have Mike in front of me, turn on the radio, the recorder, and talk to him all day long about what he could and couldn't do. Because this is absolutely amazing. Absolutely amazing. Access time itself. Create portals and walk through them yourself. Absolutely amazing. Amazing energy and amazing stuff. I'd love to interview him.